Hello everyone, FK is here and welcome to another League of Legends video. In this video I'm gonna show you Evil in Jungle and this was a pretty interesting game. And this was a pretty good game although I had a very bad start. You can see I got disconnected from the game or I got error or something and I needed to restart the client. So I got to level minute, to second minute score. I think I reconnected. So let's see. They were, they were at the bath, but okay. So at the second minute. There we go. So as you can see here, either is going on my red buff and he's gonna wait me there. He thinks that I'm gonna go to the red buff still and make the first blood, but right now I'm at the blue buff. I'm doing the blue buff here. There we go, I got it. Then I'm gonna go the gonna do the wolves. There we go. I'm doing the standard jungle path and he's gonna steal my wrath there, the big one. I saw him there, he didn't notice me, luckily. I didn't want to fight him because he had red and blue buff so I have no chance to beat him on early level. Okay, so he's gonna gank Siva here and they're gonna get first blood right here. And I'm coming bot lane to defend it but I see no point here because Caitlyn was farming and the thing is whenever you have to defend a lane or you have to just be around if someone is diet on the lane and you need to defend it always just do the something in the jungle get rats or get blue buff red buff whatever and here I'm gonna gank any and this was pretty bad thing I thought that any gonna charm her and I'm gonna just engage and get the kill but any had the buff and he did a lot of damage there sorry she did and I got my first jungle I got the spirit stone I got the boots I needed the boots so I, I could move faster although I'm Evelyn but <laughs> so again I decided to farm a little bit because I was far behind as you can see either had a lot of assistance and more CS than me in the jungle so I decided to gank there is here but I just waited the good opportunity there there we go engage and got the kill okay, let me turn that back a little bit more okay, so I waited the perfect opportunity here and there we go although Wukong didn't die luckily there we go so we got the kill there I'm gonna go and do the big goal. There we go. Okay, sorry about that. So, I'm getting the wolves again. So, I'm pretty much farming. Ari here is gonna die. She's pretty bad, you can see. She didn't have ult and she didn't ward there. Although, I think she had the wards. Yeah. Oh no. Well. She died there. I got the rats. Okay, rats. So they are done. And he had low mana, so I got gone to the base and decided to go top again. I think here, yeah, I'm gonna go get my blue buff. The point is, bottom lane was doing fine. The with the TS, they're pretty close. Although Caitlyn got one kill, that's not a big difference. Okay, let me pause that. So, she's farming. Ari was bad and I didn't think there was a point me to help her at all. As you can see, she only was two kills. And I just wanted to help Wukong more on top lane. So, again, I'm gonna gank the top lane. I'm level 6. Here... 
Wukong gonna die. Yeah, there we go. Oh, there we go. But I got my first kill. Oh no. There was assistance. Yeah. This one did. I got the assistance. <laughs> so, Arya again is gonna die here. Let's see if that was. No. You didn't use the stun. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna kill a Chango again. Oh no. Oh! Yeah, this is the part when I'm gonna die again. So I did big mistake here, I didn't have ult and she stunned me and pretty much burst me down a lot and I died again. Too much damage for me to handle, although I had magic runes, magic resistance runes, but that didn't help at all. Wukong gonna try to, to get the kill, but she's teleported to the base. Right here, Siver is doing pretty fine. She's farming and playing defensive. Leona doing her thing to make pressure so Caitlyn can farm. I'm gonna get my red buff right now. I'm just farming to catch up. Didn't want to fall behind because I died two times. So here I'm gonna get Caitlyn. I didn't have ult. My ult was seconds I think. So there we go. I ult her, we got the kill. I flashed and Q because I didn't want to I didn't want she to escape. There we go. I got my again assistance. <laughs> but again I got gold. We're gonna push a little bit here. There we go. I'm fasting the things up because I don't want the video to be very long. Okay so I'm gonna go and get the golems here. Darius and Wukong is doing she he's doing pretty fine because he's pretty catch up with Darius, they're on the same level because of the kills. I'm gonna do the rats one more. Rats. But Aries is gonna die here, as you see there. And I lost my, my ult at the end, but she stunlocked me. And I pretty much couldn't do anything there. I'm gonna back to base and I'm gonna get my item. Magic jungle item. The spirit of Spectre Rats. Okay. The bottom lane got killed Leona because Leona is pretty much playing very aggressively. So there she is. Oh she missed the stun. Yeah. And he's she's gonna die there. There you go. Okay, let me fast things up. I got my item. And I think I'm gonna go top again. Yeah, pretty much I'm always on the top. Okay, so I have I don't have ult, but I'm gonna do I'm gonna quit her once again. There was the ward, and I didn't want to go that way, so I'm gonna go to the bush. Although I'm invisible again, but I didn't want to get my vision. Where am I? I'm gonna gank him. We're gonna get the kill. We're gonna get some turn sh shots, but that's not too much damage. So I clear up the vision ward so Darius can see me. And I told. So I'm gonna tell Wogan right now to push the lane. So I'm gonna clear the lane. There we go. I'm gonna make some. I'm gonna push the lane a little bit, the torrent, get some damage. As you can see, bottom lane, Alistar was AFK, so Yudor was pretty much bot lane all the, all the time. I'm clearing once again, as you can see, current shop. I'm gonna get the blue buff here, and right here there's a team fight. And I think they're gonna escape here, they won't die, I think. Siri's doing pretty fine, and although there was a lot of pressure from Yudor on bot lane. Right here I'm, def I'm defending the top lane, I don't wanna get the top tower pushed. The bot lane also is defending pretty fine here. And once again I'm closing the jungle right here. Wukong is coming top and I think I'm gonna clear the jungle and once again I'm gonna gank top because I have ult there. So there we go, I have the blue buff, cooldown reduction, mana regeneration, everything is helping me a lot. 
The world didn't see me there. Okay, Alistar is coming back. I'm gonna ult here, slow him down, get my shield, and kill him. There we go. We so we're gonna push with Wukong here. Okay, let me fast things up. Okay, there we go. We're gonna get the tower, I think, here. Yeah, either and then he's gonna, gonna try to stop us, but we were too fast. <laughs> so, once again, pretty much I'm top lane all the time. And there we go, clearing the jungle. I had a lot of gold, almost 3000 gold. So, I'm gonna get Frozen Heart, I think. Yeah, frozen heart because of the mana cooldown reduction slowing attack speed so right here we're gonna wait for team fight here we go i'm doing my red buff um okay let me sorry about that let me turn back Ari is gonna gonna get caught here that was pretty bad she missed the charm and jared got her and he stunned her she died i got my red buff I'm gonna go here. Yuder made mistake here. They didn't have vision at all and he just engaged and we are all four here. Pretty much from my combo. Got his health in half. There we go. Leona's gonna stun her. And I'm gonna use the ult on Yuder. Gonna get my kill. See we're gonna and Wukong gonna get any. Right here, I'm gonna get Darius. Caitlyn is bot, she was clearing, so that was our play here. We catch the opportunity and we use this and won the team fight. So I called the team Let's Get Dragon. Objectives is always priority here. They knew I was doing Dragon, but they, do, they couldn't do anything about it. Here I'm gonna take a risk, I'm gonna get blue buff, although everyone is coming on blue buff here. So there they are, coming in the jungle and I'm clearing. I get low on mana and just escape, just in time. You, either you're gonna catch up me right here with a bear stand, but I got my... <laughs> I escaped with my movements. Okay. I'm playing once again here the jungle. Always do something when you're playing jungle. If you don't have nothing to defend or gank and everything, just clear the jungle, get revved, get buffs, or steal the buffs. Just do everything. So we here Alistar is gonna die. And he's gonna catch up. I'm gonna nuke him down, there we go, we got it. I'm gonna use ult here, we got two of them slowed, I got my my shield, Leona stumped Caitlyn. I get the kill, there is one more and either. I'm gonna go and catch Caitlyn here. She flashed and slowed me down but Wukong got her again, so I decided to take her down. Okay. She's gonna teleport and Wukong gonna engage one more gonna get take some turn shot but I decided to get the kill. I was still gonna stun me here. Also Zaz but because of my because of my W I didn't get any effects from exhaust. It's just kill clear every movement speed debuff or summoner spell that is using me. I get my red scamp, I got it. Then I'm gonna go get the blue buff. Pretty much I'm gonna get a lot of health from this thing. Yeah. I'm gonna get Ari. I was supposed to give the Ari the blue buff. Pretty much she was doing pretty bad in this game. 1 7. She didn't have damage, only Road, road of Ages, and she didn't have damage at all. Here thought that Ari's gonna Ari gonna get the the rat, but I cleared it out. There we go. I'm going back to base. One more time. I had 3,000 gold almost. I got 
social shoes and I didn't know that I made a mistake. I was supposed to get the movement speed. Boots, but here we're gonna have pretty bad gauge. I didn't go on any so she was just far behind and she was behind doing damage. Hurry because she didn't have damage, she didn't do almost nothing at all. And I was pretty low health, the bear's gonna kill me here. There you go. So I'm gonna clear here. I didn't notice the bear <laughs> and I died. And Siever's gonna die also. And here Andy's gonna get the triple kill, Leon just engage and that was if right now if Ari had some damage or she didn't die that much because she didn't she didn't ward at all mid lane so she can see Yuder when she's gonna gank her. That was her fault. And I decided to not help her because I would pretty much she was losing losing the game and there was no point of me giving help on that lane so I decided to give help on top lane bot lane was doing fine she, they were defending as you can see the TS is pretty much even bigger than Caitlyn although Caitlyn won the lane there because of the Uther ganks so let's continue so Ari is gonna do nothing here and there she goes and she's gonna die again and and he's gonna get triple kill and this point I told my team that first target I'm gonna nuke down is gonna be Annie because Annie just has the most damage in the team. Yuder doesn't have any item only the jungle and he was doing he was going for Trinity Force I think. And I had a lot of damage. <laughs> I had a lot just too much damage here and Okay, where am I? Okay, I'm dead. <laughs> okay, let's fast things up. So we got respawn, we clear the lane, I get my red buff, oh no, Wukong is getting the red buff, I think, yeah, I'm getting the columns, there we go, then I'm gonna clear the jungle again, I think, oh no, this was the, this was the time where I gauge any with my ult, I thought I can nerf her down, I can nuke her down, Sorry, nuke her down, but okay, there we go. She's gonna stun me here. We can't gonna do anything. She got stun locked by Alistair stun. So I'm going back. I'm gonna get the the the, the wolf here. Either gonna get the top. And there we go. So we're gonna stack mid here. We waited for Wukong. Wukong came here. User is gonna take the dragon. I didn't notice that and I put ward here I think. Yeah. And here I put the ward. I didn't notice that user was here. So they got free bear free dragon here. And I went this way to check. But there was nobody and they got dragon. So now the team is gonna gauge here and I'm going this way to check dragon and I noticed that they got a dragon and I'm coming back and just wait in the in the side there so Leona is gonna engage here as you can see Ari once more she missed the the charm and I got my ult on four people here so bam on four people just melted down and we got here I'm gonna get any Bam. and I think Alistar and pretty much I got a lot of gold a lot of gold from this so we're gonna get mid torrent I think so pretty much we seized our team fights and we got better engagement than they Although they had the vision on the jungle, but they couldn't do everything because pretty much I got the ult on three of them and they got slowed, I got big shield and I nicked them down. 
So we got the turn here. I'm going full AP here as you can see. I could go AD, more tanky. And Evelyn with the AD build is also pretty powerful. But I'm going with AP because I had the room. My room page was made for AP Evelyn. There we go. I'm gonna get the get some TS here. I'm gonna get back. I'm gonna get to. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go to the blue buff. You don't wanna catch me up here, but then you'll do anything. A ward here. I'm gonna get my blue buff. Although I have a lot of gold, I think. Yeah, almost. 3000 again but they're gonna come here and decided to just come come back there we go they will come here she's gonna out and here i also gonna use my once more my ult bam there we go To see the damage. Bam. I'm gonna ult here, I think. Yeah, ult her. There we go. I got the kill. Here I'm gonna finish Alistar. And I'm gonna finish Annie and got get the quasi kill. And I was solo on HP, but still I got the kill. <laughs> and in this point they're gonna surrender the game. And pretty much that was GG. So what mistakes I did in this game? The mistakes was I didn't wait for Ari on the early game to to engage. Okay, let me just fast things up. Okay. So this was the point where I did my first mistake. I shouldn't, I never should have done that. I should have waited the hour to get the charm, then I should engage and pretty much we could kill her there, but I didn't do that. That was the only, that was the first mistake and the second mistake was when I died the second, the second time for Annie. And because I thought that Hari was pretty much couldn't do anything against any and I decided to just gank more top and make pressure from top lane so Wukong get the farm and gets pretty powerful and so pretty much that's it just wait the perfect opportunities never just stand in the bush or wait for a gank or wait for the just wait for a few seconds like five seconds six seconds and if nothing happened just turn back and continue your farming or defend the lane if if you there's nobody there just defend the lane don't let them get the turrets all the objectives are always more important than the kills just remember that so pretty much that's everything this is my also first commentary and just on this video this is also the first time i even played evelyn on jungle i just made some rune pages and just test her out to see if I can clear jungle with her so I got my perfect room page for me I think which is 80 marks 80 damage marks armor seals magic resistance and AP queens so that's that was my build on, uh, on Evelyn so so pretty much that's it I hope you liked the video I'm gonna make more videos if I get more interesting game like this although we maybe we wouldn't want the game if Alistar was alive pretty much when Alistar reconnected and we had team fights Alistar was pretty low level but he was just few minutes disconnected so I didn't think that's gonna impact that much on the game so thanks for watching if you like the video feel free to subscribe write a comment and like the video thanks for watching